What's up, everybody? Welcome to episode 21 of the WWF WCW Monday Night Wars. I am Chad Talks. That's my homie, J-Mac Gaming. Yo. And today, we are doing Monday Night Raw. Now, just so you know, uh, actually, well, never mind. What? Never mind. Where were you, say, where were you say, going with that? I was, I was going to say I did some spring cleaning of my roster, but I guess I could just wait and tell you that when we do my show. Let's look at my incidents and, oh no, where is this going? Oh, dear <laughs> God. I can only imagine. Here we go. Luna Vachon was brought into the wrestler's court, accused of failing to pick up her share of the tab. Jerry Lawler found her guilty and sentenced her to pay the full cost. Good. Oh, good for you, Luna. That was very unperverted, sexist, misogynistic of Jerry Lawler to do. Alright, that's. I, I was really worried right there. Luna Vachon must call herself Puppy the rest of her <laughs> Puppy. Sean funny. Stasiak in the pre-show match of the day. Who did I sign? The, oh, Buddy Sergeant Buddy Lee Parker. There we go. Oh, I signed him for not an in-ring competitor. Hmm. Great. Oh, that was a waste of money. Gold, James Ellsworth. Uh, <laughs> uh, I already used Volkov, didn't I? So, Tataka. Pretty sure you've used Tataka, too. I don't think I did. Fair enough. Alright, here we go. A, what the fuck's a boot camp match? You can even pin him at the hot dog stand. <laughs> ah. that's, that's fantastic. Alright, let's go with the... the su- no, not the such. Sean Stasiak, who won the belt at the Royal Rumble and I forgot to sign him. So, he's back. He's... Ready to reclaim his belt again. <laughs> I want he I want that pre show title. It means the world to me. And Tatanka. So there we go. Sean State. Oh, I'm gonna random that one. I'm gonna random it. Boom. And we're gonna start off Monday Night Raw with an angle. Here we go. We got Vince and Sean McCall's in the ring. Vince is upset. He's gonna bitch left the shit out of Sean. Vince is upset with how the main event last week went down. And I'm not gonna fit this in, but Shawn Michaels, Vince is gonna tell Shawn Michaels now that he has to take on each of those three men that he beat up last week in single matches leading up to the show, to the main of, uh, to the pay-per-view. All will be non-title. But whoever beats Shawn Michaels in those matches will move on to take on Shawn Michaels for the title. And no what way if out. one of them beat him? Then Shawn Michaels is going to have an easy day. <laughs> and Shawn Michaels have an easy month at that he's pay-per-view. Gonna, he's not going to have a match at the pay-per-view. Spoiler alert, someone's going to beat him. All three, perhaps? Who knows? That's, we're going to start off the match traditionally with a uh, cruiserweight belt. A cruiserweight belt. Cruiserweight match. Kid Let Cash. Let match, you fuck. Kid Cash making his debut. Uh, oh my fucking Fedora versus Fedora. Fedora versus Fedora. <laughs> they could be tag partners. Kid Cash okay. taking off. Cash, cash and fu- fucking Cash. <laughs> Flash Funk going to get the win over Kid Cash. Flash Cash. I like that. Kid Funk. <laughs> Kid Funk. Ew. I like Cash. I like Flash Cash better. Flash Cash. Funk Kid. There we go. And we're going to have a match right there. Boom. Flash Funk going to get the win, but Kid Cash is going to be held strong. And we're going to have a post match. Post match stare down. Bob Holly's going to come out. And they're going to have a stare down. We're going to move on to the next. Um, next angle. The Rock is in his locker room. Michael's not there. Michael didn't show up today, and The Rock is upset with him. <laughs> where? Where's Michael? The Rock wants to know where Michael Cole is. <laughs> for, for no showing. Boom. 
The rack's upset. Uh, Michael, call off screen, entertainment, and microphone. Boom. And we're gonna have a The Rock in his eleventh title match taking on Roddy Piper. Roddy mm -hmm. Piper getting getting a win over Drunk and High Jake Roberts. I think he deserves something I after dealing with that. The Rock will get the win, keeping Roddy Piper strong. Decisive win. Boom, boom, boom. I have to go back and make this a car crash. The Rock versus Piper. Has that ever happened? <sighs> I don't think so. Man, dream matches. It may have. I don't think a one-on-one. -on -one. They may have been Survivor Series opponents or something like that. Like 5v5. Uh, Post-match. Post-match. Where The Rock is going to beat down Roddy Piper. I think The Rock is heel, and I think Roddy Piper's heel. Fuck! I don't really care. It's gonna happen regardless. We're gonna move on to a Fatal Form Way match between the guys of the tag team who weren't in the fucking match last week. We got Bradshaw, Blackjack, Wyndham. Oh, now they're going to. F it is a Raw. It is a WWE <laughs> Raw. Christian Cage and Mosh. The They're, other the other headbanger. Bradshaw's still hurt. I can give two shits. It's gonna continue like that. And then we're gonna have a fucking huge Just a brawl. All eight men are just gonna brawl after the match. Christian, Mosh and Thrasher. Ahmed and Blackjack. It's going to be a brawl. A brawl for all? Brawl for all. I should sign Butterbean. You do have Bark Gun. Oh, oh! now he's in developmental. I sent that bitch down there. He's oh, 34. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> he's in developmental. Jesus. Uh, we're going to move on to a bank stage angle. With a team of Vader and Ken Shamrock are in their locker room. They're now officially a team in my head. We have a, uh, Vader and Shamrock. Oh, how original. Shut up. Team, and <laughs> team, big, team Big Booty. <laughs> team Big Fat Piece of Shit. <laughs> in the locker room. Talking. Talking, you know, getting their groove on. In comes Mankind. Wants a match tonight. Vader accepts. Vader will accept. So we're getting Mankind and Vader. Man, that's random and spontaneous. Hey, Mankind's just looking for a match. That's his gimmick. He just goes around the locker room and asks people for matches. Have a nice day. Have Mankind vs. Vader right here. 15 minutes. Vader gonna look strong. Get the win. Keep Mankind strong though. Go. We are gonna move on to another a random match right here. Goldust is gonna be back. He's taking on Jeff Jarrett. And Goldust is going to get the win. I would hope so. Keep Jeff Jarrett strong. But the outside distraction by Luna Vashan. There we go. And then a post-match attack. Press match, beat down. Jeff Jarrett's going to get beaten down by Goldust and Luna. <laughs> poor, poor Jeff Jarrett. We're going to have uh, another backstage as uh, Howard Finkel. Fink sues China. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. He is upset we're getting beaten down, and he's going to sue her. I'm going to sue your ass. 
<laughs> and then our main event, Shawn Michaels stole cold. Big that's match. Very short, un like there's not that many segments today. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just. This, this, I'm uh, just, just a, uh, it's a filler pay per view. So I don't, the storylines aren't in depth as much right now, in my head. Um, I got you. Stone Cold getting the win. See, I got Super Brawl. Mine's a big show. Yeah. A frog splashed through the table, and the table didn't break. Oh, boy. Poor Kevin Owens. Distraction. Kane is going to distract Shawn Michaels. <laughs> He's doing it again. There you go. What about a post-match or pre-show tag team match? Between guys who have not been in the Los Barricos. Taking on fucking um, the Kurgan, tag team champions, <laughs> Kurgan and Recon. I just want to get everyone on the show. Savio, are the Pensa Puerto Rico's gonna get the win? Oh fuck yeah! Not the main event. No, I was supposed to make that a pre-show. Want one more pre-show match? Who hasn't? Steve Blackman takes on Al Snow. Steve Blackman and Al Snow. Have Mark Marrow in there, too. Just the most generic triple threat sure. in the world. I need a interview 2v2. Where Hawk and Animal. Road Dog and... What's his fucking name? Billy Gunn. One minute thing. Put this... I'll put this right in the middle between Mankind... Jeff Jarrett and Stone. I'm gonna have a Stone Cold Steve Austin celebrates. Stone Cold celebrating to end the show. There we go. Let's run this bad boy. Let's run this bad boy show. Here we go. In a pre-show bout that had subpar wrestling a little heat, Tatanka beats Sean Stasiak with an Indian Death Drop. Tatanka. Forgot to make that match for the pre-show belt. <laughs> Sorry, Tatanka. So Stasiak still has a chance. In a terrible pre-show match, Los Barricos defeats the Truth Commission when the Prince of Puerto Rico wins with a Paralizadora. Safio Vega carried the match in performance. Oh, fucking Christ. I am in a pre-show about to have decent wrestling, but Little Heat Steve Blackman defeated Al Snow with a guillotine choke. Let's Three move. pre-show matches, man. Let's move on. Oh, <laughs> look at that. A wow. plus. Look at that, buddy. I should just run that every fucking promo. <laughs> <laughs> Vince is upset with Shawn Michaels and uh, how he interfered in the, the main event last week. So he tells Shawn Michaels, Yo, damn it. <laughs> Uh, he tells them that he will have three one-on-one -on -one matches with the three opponents, one on each Raw, and whoever beats him is in a title match at No Way Out. Shawn Michaels loses his fucking mind. I want to move on to a light heavyweight match between Kid Cash. What the fuck, dude? 28? And about that is terrible wrestling and non-existent crowd heat. Flash Funk defeats Kid Cash. So Kid Cash sucks. Just yeah, Kid Cash not having that good a debut. Uh, Bob Holly comes out and stares Flash Funk down. Oh boy. Oh Bob. boy, the, the money feud. Uh, the Rock is backstage and he's upset that Michael didn't show up to tell him who <laughs> is his who his fucking opponent is this week. So we just delve into the match where The Rock and Roddy Piper have a match. Roddy Piper taking The Rock to the limit, but The Rock somehow gets the win. And Piper beats him down after, uh, no, I may, or, uh, hmm. Roddy Piper is celebrating in the, his victory in the ring. The Rock runs in and attacks him, beating <laughs> Piper down. Uh, uh, you stupid old man, I won the match. <laughs> All right, whatever. And about that, a decent wrestling in Little Heat. Mosh defeat, Mosh won, what the fuck? Hmm. Uh, Branshaw... 
was really working through an injury, should probably not have him in a match. So, eh, decent match. See, that's what I expect from my mid cards. And we have the eight man brawl, you know, just to beat each other up. Uh, Vader and Shamrock are in their locker room, jacking each other off while Mankind comes oh. in. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's the face Ken Shamrock made the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Mankind, his new gimmick is just walking around asking people for matches. So he goes in the locker room and uh, he's like, Can I have a match? And Vader accepts it. He wants. He, he's taking on Mankind. And about that, like, great wrestling and good heat. Vader defeated Mankind in 1521 with a power bomb. Good match, good match. Legion of Doom had an interview hyping up their upcoming tag team match with the New Age Outlaws. Okay. We're moving on to a decent match with Goldust and Jeff Jarrett when Goldust pins Jeff Jarrett after Luna Vashon distracted Double J. And then they beat him down like the little bitch he is. Oh, I'm suing China for attacking me backstage. And the China, fake... I'm going to take your ass to court. <laughs> oh, no. And then we're going to move on to the main event. Stone Cold defeating Shawn Michaels uh, in 1340. So Shawn Michaels has one opponent now. Stone Cold. Kane distracted Shawn Michaels to get Stone Cold to win. He's upset. He doesn't care. And Stone Cold celebrates the end of the show let's look at how we did an 84 b plus boys here we go we're starting to make gains on wcw it was all because of the fink all because of the fink all because of mankind and kid cash you know my show does not start off good it just have one good main event match <laughs> right my show usually sucks. <laughs> All right, that was. Oh man, what episode was this? Twenty-one. Episode twenty-one of me and Chad talks. TW Monday Night War series. Leave a like, leave a comment. I'm going through this field because Chad's too distracted with the main event of Roadblock right now. That's not true. <laughs> I am. I was distracted. <laughs> yeah, come on, Summer Rae. Um, no, nah, yeah, it was, they just got the main event done. Who won? Uh, uh, Kevin Owens won. Oh, good. Jericho came out, hit a code breaker on Kevin Owens. Why? So that Kev- well, it, it was. It looked like it was going to be a face turn, and then and then Jericho attacked him. But then afterwards, Jericho like stood up and like smiled at Owens because. Oh, 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 because him attacking Owens made him win by DQ. Oh, that's how they ended it? Yeah, well, and now Seth Rollins and Owens, or now Rollins and Reigns are beating up Jericho and Oh, okay. Alright, well, that was episode 21. Spoiler alerts if you haven't watched Roadblock when this episode comes out. Yeah, spoiler alert if you haven't watched Roadblock by now. Uh, thank you. This is probably going to be well past Roadblock. Yeah, this, alright. Thank you guys for watching, listening, tuning in, subscribing, liking, not disliking, thank you. And we'll see you for episode 22. When we book some W, W, not F, (laughs) WCW. You can't even put over your own show. We should go, we we should really write scripts. (laughs) (laughs) Alright, see you guys later. See ya, man.